on, you are on. Um, concerning the topic for today. Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, the issue of the NSC, the, the, the president can, um, um, Is it your line? Uh, you know, uh, 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 either I scrap out the, the NSC or convert the NSC to the Minister uh, to the Minister of Sports. Okay. Uh, chuf, chuf, I, it's like you are, you are close to your telly. Can you move away from the telly? Your phone is like there's an interference. Can you so, move away? So the issue of uh, is it, is it, is it, is it, we can uh, we can have the Ministry of uh, the Minister of Sports and that of the uh, 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 NSC. So it is better with the Minister of Sports or contact that of the uh, 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 NSC to, 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 to Minister of Sports. I think what we need to do from the bottom down. Before you start, because if if we say that we are having a ministry of sports like that, it becomes politics. But if we say we have a chairman of the NSC, it becomes a technocrat taking that job. That is why I am saying the ministry of sports should be scrapped. Now, Chuck just told us here now that we can we we can rename. Either you scrap with the ministry that's or, or I, I name, agree with him. Name, name but and like we always have a problem in that. That's what I'm saying. If okay. we come from the top down, they will give you a political minister. But if we go from the from the ministry of uh, the NSC, look for somebody with you him. must get a technology to hide the head that thing and upgrade him. I will have an Okay, okay. okay. <laughs> there's a challenge there. Yeah. We have we have from Mr. Kobola yes. who told us that even from where he wants to get them, mm. the supposedly a chairman of the board. That seventy percent of them are rampex in square holes. So where do you find the technical from? I think I think this is where we need. To, <laughs> I think this is where we need to use our sports as yeah. a as a crossroads. Now it's either we get it right now okay. or we forget about it forever. Now is the era of change. We can't forget it. Is, I'm, I'm telling you. Okay, so the era of change. So what what, what, what what needs to be changed? If we want to do the right thing, yeah. which I think we go a long way in helping us, is. With, is either we set up a kind of committee that are really you technocrats. You're you 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 starting with committees. Uh, no, that, that are really technocrats. I, I, I'm looking okay, at okay, it. It's, it's, I'm, it's, it's, I'm, it's, I'm, I'm talking about knowledge. Please. No, no, no. no but, I'm but, trying to profess solution to this thing. But do you because agree because that, the thing is conflicting. Tunji, and it's, Tunji, and it's Tunji, causing Tunji, a whole lot of, uh, you know, Tunji, you have you, 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 you had the conjure from Chuk's day. Yes. He says, you have National Sport Commission Standing side by side Let us with Minister of Sports. Yeah. I mean, you, you minister. That is why we need there. someone who is grounded. Ken, 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 when you Ken, bring Ken, in Ken, someone Ken, who is grounded, let us give an example. It's just let's to oversee okay, like an overseer. We have, we have not just let, football let, minister. Let's, let's football. Let's leave football. Oh. Before, we, before we do, let us, let us, let us take our next caller. Hello. 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 Good afternoon. Good afternoon, my dear. Yeah. Bless you. I, I'm interested in the ongoing discussion. Thank you. I am I'm not a football analyst or a sports analyst, but I'm interested in issue of policy the policy process. Good. Now, if you say that we shouldn't have a sports minister, yeah. I do not know at the level of policy formulation who will speak for sports. I do know that the head of the National Sports Commission or NFF is not a member of the Federal Executive Council where policy is formulated. So if you cut off spot from policy formulation, I would like to know from you, sir, who will support at the level of policy formulation? Iboru, uh, uh, yes, we have always had this issue where the Minister of Sport also is the chairman of the National Sport Commission. He asks, he asks if you know, that is, there are two portfolios that, you know, one in this... That he that is carrying, one as minister of sport, and the other one as you know uh, the chairman of the national sport commission. What I, I'm saying. Yeah. Hello, hello. You are, you are on. You are on. You are still on. What What I'm saying yeah. is simple. You know, I've already I've already entered a caveat. 
Yes. And I say I am not a sports analyst. Yes, we, we, we had that, yes. I'm only interested I'm only interested at the interface between sport and policy, and policy formulation. Yes. Okay. And then I'm asking you, if you say we should not have a sports minister, who will be in the Federal Executive Council to speak for sport? Oh yeah, listen to listen listen listen, listen to him. Of the National Sport Board is the NSC chairman. If you don't listen to him, or permitted, or is the NSC chairman that the right to, to be a member of the Federal Executive yes. Council? Yes, because the NSC chairman by law should be a cabinet minister. All right, he said the NSC, the NSC chairman yeah, of NSC should be, be a, a cabinet, cabinet minister. So you upgrade him, no more no, as, meaning no more as. as. All right. Uh, uh, now I understand what Igoru is trying to say there. Talking about right. policy formulation. I mean, where, where we, does it come from? He's, he's talking we, about, he's, he's talking about know. you know, a bottom up and we, not top down. We know. That's what he said. And that's what Igoru is saying. We know. The policy formulation, which yeah. are supposed to be bottom up, yeah. who does that? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, now, when you say some, someone is a National Sports Commission chairman, yeah. You know, and it goes to, you know, a meeting where you have ministers, yeah. as it were. Yeah. You know, you know, he's acting in the role in that capacity. He's not acting by law. By law. By law. Okay, I agree. The NSC chairman by law. is a I agree. minister. By law. By law. But I agree. No, but the name alone. There's no inferiority. The name alone. It doesn't matter. Okay, all right. It doesn't matter about the name. Okay. All right. Your last left. Your 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 close. Just have your closing remarks. Well, sport is too big. Yeah. To be relegated you know, with just NSC chairman, is something that when you look at it, but you have to look at the structure, the foundation again. When the foundation is faulty, what can we do at this point? Go back to the foundation. Try to build the foundation. Over the years, we have, we have had football ministers. How do we correct this problem? Let us look at it, not relegating the minister tag that we have for sports. That is not the solution. 30 seconds. Your last minute. Yes. Tunji, we cannot, we, cannot, we cannot rectify the problem by saying that we name another minister whom we know would al always be a politician. The NSC must produce a technocrat to head that group so that the part of the NSC is, 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 they, they said they should do research. Have you, have, you, have you heard of any research done on sports in Nigeria? Okay. Have you heard of any research done in Nigeria? Or great, or what do you want to know? <laughs> or like he says, mm -mm, scrap. But then appoint the chairman of NSC and let him be of cabinet you know, level. Yes. So the president, the board is in your court. Are you keeping or scrapping the Minister of Sports? The discussion continues. And Ken Ochonogo, my guys, shake, have your hands shake. <laughs> All right. My friend. Have <laughs> a Palama free afternoon. I'm Ken Ochonogo. Stay blessed.